Good day everyone, here I'll be showing you how to remove the shortcut arrows from application icons on Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. Now let's dive straight to it. Proceed to the search bar. I'm going to type in registry right here. Registry. Click on registry editor. If you get any notification, click yes. Here in the registry editor, go down to HK local machine. On the left side here, click on this arrow to expand it. Now go down to software expand software now we're going to look for microsoft right here expand this and i'm going to go down again all the way down look for windows yes windows expand this as well go to current version expand it and now we're going to scroll down a bit here look for explorer proceed to right click on explorer go on to new then select key. If we look down here, we can see this new key. Just highlight on it, right click on it. I'm going to select rename. So we're going to rename these to shell icons. Please type it just the way I've typed it. Shell icons starting with capital S and capital I. Tap on enter. Highlight on shell icons. Proceed to the right side here. Just right click on here. Go to new and I'm going to select string value. And again, we're going to rename these to 29. Tap on enter. All right. Now proceed to open these. Double click on that. Right here, below value data, we're going to enter this file path. Percent WinDIR percent backslash system32 backslash again shell32.dll, comma, negative 50. To make this easy, guys, I'm going to be leaving this file path in the description so you can just copy and paste it as it is once you're done with that just go right here and click on ok so now i'm going to minimize this first as we can see this arrow is still there to finalize this step you have to restart your computer otherwise go right here to your tax bar right click on it and go to tax manager so right here in tax manager under processes you're going to look for windows explorer just highlight on Windows Explorer, right click on it and select restart. So here's the problem though. For some users, you might get this black box right here. To solve this, I'm going to give you a very quick solution to this. Um, I'm going to minimize this and go back to the registry editor. And right here, we're going to double click on this 29 again. Double click on that. Now we're going to delete this part right here. Highlight on it, delete it, click on OK. Now if we go back here and restart this file explorer, as we can see, this problem is solved and we don't have these annoying arrows anymore. There's no much of benefit to this other than making this desktop look clean, unique and organized. That's it about this video. Uh, remember to subscribe to this channel. See you in the next video.